this is Jeff from My Food Better and Your Mom and today we are going to be making sushi for dummies. We're going to be making a sushi bowl. You ready? Let's go. Alright guys, so we are going to start with our rice. We are going to wash our rice. This is very, very important for sushi uh, rice because if we don't do this, probably it's going to be very sticky and it's not going to be very good for us. So what we're going to do is, we're just going to, this is for two people, so I'm going to put in two of this. The ratio is going to be one rice and one and a half water, okay? So I'm going to be using two of rice. So like I said, I'm going to give this a couple of really, really good washes but that mean like wash it really well the water is gonna come like white then keep washing until the water comes clean our rice is already cooking I added three cups of water remember the ratio that's gonna be one cup of rice and one and a half cups of, uh, of water so at the moment it's a medium heat and once it starts boiling we are gonna turn it down to a low to a low simmer and let it rest all right so my tuna is ready from the can so now all we're going to do is we are gonna add one I would say like one and a half teaspoons of good quality mayo and just a little bit of sriracha I would say like half a teaspoon all right so now let's just combine everything and this is going to be ready to go I had to change bowls because the other one was a little bit too small. I could have gotten a bigger one. Um, this is pretty much ready to go. And now we're going to work on our fresh tuna fish and our fresh salmon. You see all these fibers or nerves going this direction. You do not want to cut like this. Because otherwise everything is going to fall apart. We're going to cut in this direction. So. We are going to just make very thin slices. We're just gonna keep... We are going to wash our rice. This is very, very important for sushi uh, rice because if we don't do this, probably it's gonna be very sticky and it's not gonna be very good for us. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna... This is for two people. So I wanna put in two of this. Very carefully, try not to waste like... I'm wasting a lot of delicious fish in here. Don't be an idiot like me. Just pull, cut, pull, cut. Now that we finally managed to remove the skin out of our salmon, we're just gonna thinly slice it, just like our tuna. Very, very thin stripes against the grain. Now that our rice is ready, we are going to add we're actually going to combine our vinegar I'm going to use around that amount which is a quarter of a cup and we are going to add around an eighth of a cup of sugar that would be around three teaspoons that sounds good that's good enough and we are going to add some salt a tablespoon of that and we're just gonna put it in the microwave for like 30 seconds just to get warm enough so we can dissolve everything now that our rice is finally finished it's still warm though so this just came out of the microwave the sugar has dissolved the salt as well so we're just gonna add it little by little and then you can just adjust it to taste very carefully we're just going to mix it up right this might take a little bit of, of time because we need to let the rice cool off all right guys now that our rice finally has cooled off we are going to plate up so we are just going to grab our lettuce just like that we're just gonna put a little bit there we go we're going to grab our rice. Time to put our goodies on top of it. Ready? 
we're going to start with our salmon. Oh man, this is already like looking amazing. I haven't done shit to it yet. Now we're moving to our fresh tuna fish. And bringing everything in. Woo wee! Last, but definitely not least, our sriracha mayo tuna. Ta-da! Sushi bowl. Really, really simple, guys. Really delicious. Let's dig in. Alright guys, so if you like this video, give me a big thumbs up, always subscribe, and if you've got any questions, post them in the comment section down below. I'm Jeff from my pet I <laughs> I'm Jeff from my cook better and your mom, and I'll see you next time. Peace!